Hey Scorpio, what's up my darling water sign, how you doing? Everyone thinks Scorpios are fire signs, in my opinion, a lot of people are like, oh Scorpios are water sign, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Welcome to the Gifted Hermit guys, I'm going to be doing a love reading, then I'm going to pull out some angel and crystal cards at the end, alright? This love reading picks up on two energies and three questions, it is how you're viewing each other, what you want from each other, and where you both believe that it's going all right if you find that this reading resonates with you it's not going to resonate with everybody it's a general right but if it does resonate with you in any way scorpio please give me a thumbs up show some love my sexies let's get it first energy please right so we've got the eight of pentacles mm. followed by the three of wands wow i like this queen of swords nice Next energy, please, for Scorpios. Wow, 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 wow. Okay, I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. I, okay, Scorpio, I feel like... So, this is not going to be for everybody, but I feel like I'm not jumping into the reading. Someone doesn't feel like they're being treated equally. Like you're not being fair, Scorpio. This could be them. This could be them, and they're not treating you fairly. Because remember, it's... Um, transferable energy all right and i say that because the justice cards came out reversed and then we've got the tower and then we've got the king of swords fuck me so with the king of swords there and the queen of swords some of you are definitely in twin flame situations if you don't know what i'm on about twin flame there's a little read there in the description box below on my website go ahead and read up on that okay and uh, leave a comment let me know if you know if you're dealing with your twin flame right let's jump into this reading so the first energy, okay, could be you, it could be them. Someone's viewing somebody here as very hard at work, a very hard worker, okay? Eight of Pentacles. This talks about uh, learning, wanting to learn new things. Somebody that's willing to put their head down. Somebody that's willing to give in, not give in, give all of their work. Give, give all their time, their effort. This is hard work, okay? This is doing whatever it's got to take. To succeed and this is how someone's viewing somebody here pretty much as a very hard worker it's lovely energy okay someone that loves to learn always wanting to know more always wanting to learn new things someone that's uh able to put their head down okay no matter what uh life may bring right what they want somebody is wanting to move forward okay we've got the three of wands it might be that someone has their back on you right now as in the illustration because the illustrations always paint a story here as well but ultimately someone's viewing somebody here is wanting to move forward it might be that they want to move away scorpio it could be your energy it could be their energy right but most certainly somebody is wanting to move forward either with you or without you It's like, I got, you know, I got stuff to do. I got to live my life. There's more to world. There's more to life than this is what someone wants me to say there in the universe. The Queen of Swords, very intellectual energy. The Queen of Swords, very direct. Okay. This energy is, um, no, the question is where they believe it's going. Okay. So someone believes perhaps that they have to be very logical about a situation here okay someone feels like they're going to learn from this they're going to become more intelligent as well the queen of swords is like no nonsense okay so someone believes that they're going to take no nonsense anymore they're going to be direct they're going to be straightforward they're going to get stronger they will judge if they need to judge. They will say what they need to say. They will be upfront and open and honest and very quick, quick witted. Yeah. Lively and intellectual energy here. Moving on to the next energy. All right. Again, this could be you or then someone's viewing somebody here. And with it coming out reverse, for some of you, it could be that you're not you're not being fair right now. OK. For others of you. This is very fair energy. This is very direct. This is equality. This is uh, giving love to all. It's Libra energy, guys, all right? Um, 
<coughs> the justice card talks about legal situations as well. But this is about harmony. So someone's viewing somebody here as either not harmonious or very harmonious, okay? Very fair or not fair at all. Someone's viewing somebody here as very objective or not objective, right? Someone's viewing somebody here as very direct when they're making their decisions or very wishy-washy, okay? Someone believes that they're being treated equally sexually or not. Mm -hmm. Going on to the wants, okay? The tower card. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Somebody is wanting significant change, Scorpio, all right? They want major change with... I don't know. You tell me. What do they want major change with? Okay. Well, this is major change in some aspects. Okay. This is um, a breakdown. This is the God. God's hand, hand, uh, God's work. Okay. This is God's work. Leaving it to God. Somebody wants to leave it to God. Okay. Somebody probably wants to have a change in fortune, in their luck. They're not feeling like luck is on their side right now. Okay. Maybe someone wants to start some shit up. Someone's ready to start something up. Maybe as well, Scorpio, you know. Don't shoot the messenger. I'm here to warn you. I'm here to give you some insight. <laughs> <clears throat> and then, the King of Swords. Okay, so someone believes again. I think you're both believing in the same sort of energy. King of Swords, very direct, very diplomatic, um, very precise. And using their logic again. So someone believes. I think there's a conversation that's going to be had here. For both parties. Okay. Someone believes that they have to be very assertive. This is either with you or you with them. Yes. Someone thinks, thinks that they're going to be giving a fair judgment here. My darling. Someone has high standards. You both have high standards. Let's be Rizzle. You both have high standards. Right, that's enough of all the lovey dubby. Scorpios, I'm going to pull out some crystal cards for you. What's the message for Scorpio, please and thank you? Okay, you've got Malachite, I believe. Wow. Scorpio, this card, well, we'll go to the questions in a minute. You're dealing with Archangel Raphael, and it says, I find balance within. I feel my feelings and embrace my emotions. Love swells into my life. I recognize repetitive patterns. I choose patterns of love, compassion, and kindness. I focus on my heart center. Okay, that's your heart chakra, my darlings. I treasure the lessons I learn through being in relationships with others. Okay, so there's a lot of lessons to be learned here with the people that you are around. Okay. What patterns in your life do you keep repeating? Walk the inner labyrinth and find the highest spiritual purpose for your challenges and lessons, Scorpio. Discover and release the patterns that no longer serve you, Scorpio. Look for the emerging patterns of joy, harmony and inner peace. Move forward in your evolutionary spiral upwards, okay? So you know what's good for you, okay? And what is good for the goose is also good for the gander. I loved that reading. I really did. I hope you found it somewhat insightful. Uh, that's angels telling me to remind you. In the description box below, uh, there's going to be a read about Twin Flame Energy. Go ahead and read that. And my manifestation post that I've just put up on the website. So if you're trying to manifest something in your life, something that you really desire, y'all better go and read that, okay? Read it before bed or something like that. Take notes. There's so much tips there how you can start manifesting today. All right, Scorpio, please give me a thumbs up if I resonate with you. Hopefully you can join me on the community on Instagram and Facebook. If you want a personal, you can also do that through the website. Love, peace and light, Scorpio. Be kind to others, but most importantly, be kind to you. Catch you on the rebound. Mwah.